Welcome back to JKP Rising. My name is James. Thank you for watching once again. So today's topic is a little bit old, but I wanted to talk about it anyway because there was something that actually kind of, I was kind of 50-50 on it. It actually did a little bit bother me and a little bit did not bother me because one, well, first off, I'm talking about Halo 5, the darkest Halo game is going to be rated T for Teen. Which kind of makes me scratch my head going, wait a minute, if it's the darkest Halo game, why is it teen when the other games were M? Does this jerk me the wrong way? Honestly, it does a little bit. It does a little bit. Is it a huge deal? No, no, it's not a big deal at all because Halo never was M material. It never was. Maybe a few instances in the game, we have evolved in terms of what is appropriate and what is not appropriate and what is labeled as offensive or what is labeled as mature. Halo never really was a mature game. It was very light for being a mature game. So having the ESRB rate Halo 5 as teen, I mean, I always known Halo to be teen. It's not a big deal to I me. Mean, this is brings more people into Halo because some parents are super strict and like, I'm not letting you play Halo even though it's not realistic at all. Or not realistic in terms of present time. Halo could very well be what it is now in the far distant future. Halo 5, or like Halo in general, never was M-rated at all. Like, it never really felt M to me. I played Halo when I was 8 years old and I'm relatively sane. It was never M material in my opinion, but I always knew Halo to be an M-rated game. And now that Halo is a teen game, it doesn't mean anything. It doesn't. I'm sure there's people out there that understand where I'm coming from. You are slightly disappointed in a way that it's not M anymore. At the same time, it never really did anything for Halo in general. I mean, this will probably increase sales because now a larger audience can now access Halo 5. And you don't have to have an M-rated game to tell a really amazing story. You know, Portal 2 is rated E for everyone and that game had an amazing story. Halo 5 being teen is not a big issue. It is kind of surprising because it is the darkest Halo game, but it's teen. But you know, that's just times. Back in the day, you couldn't show nudity on TV and now if you watch HBO, that's all over the place. Back in the day, like Walking Dead, if that aired 60 years ago, it would have been banned across all channels. And now you can watch kids getting their face blown off or getting ripped apart by zombies. But if they show a nipple or a pussy or a big flaming cock, that's not allowed. That's one thing that really bugs me. It's like, wait a minute, you can show people getting murdered, but you can't show nudity? What the fuck's up with that? I mean, if I want to see pussy, I just go on Pornhub or Google Images and I turn the filter off. Or just watch porn in general, because porn is awesome when you're bored or don't have a girlfriend or a boyfriend or whatever you are. Pansexual bisexual, straight, gay, homosexual, I don't care, whatever. We're all animals, man. We're all human. Getting back to Halo 5. <laughs> yeah, Halo 5 is all about story, and that's what Halo's always been about. It's never been about the M rating. It's always been about the story, and as long as Halo 5 has good screenwriters and good script editors and good writing material, I'm going to enjoy the game. That's pretty much it for this video. Short video. I am working on a new format for my channel. Possibly a new intro. Just something more than just me showing basic Reach gameplay. I want to mix it up. I don't want to copy people on YouTube, but it's very hard to be original. I don't want to mix machinima with this because that's really annoying and it's a pain in the ass. I'm already doing rain and I want to do that versus just doing machinima with this, but I'm going to try to figure out how I can blend something with it. I might do what B. Dobbins does, but I want to mix it up and make it my own. So I'm still thinking about how to make my channel a bit more revolutionized, a bit more out there, a bit more original. I am currently, I have two videos in production that I want to do and that I want to test out that new layer out, which hopefully, if I have enough time this week, I'll try to implement those changes this week and upload them this week. That's my thoughts on Halo 5 being teen. It's not a big deal. It does kind of suck because it's been M all this time, but it's not a big deal at all because Halo is all about story, not about the M rating. Let me know what you people think about Halo 5 being teen for teen. Do you think it's still going to be the darkest Halo yet, or do you think just because it's teen, it's not going to be as dark as M games, like Gears of War? Thanks for watching my videos. Stay tuned for some more videos on JKB Rising, and I'll see you next time. Peace out.